Hello, Georgia B here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. I made this card using the stamp set Friendly Hello from Stampin' Up! obviously and it's from the Celebration. You have to spend £90 to get this stamp set free. In this stamp set I am using the bird and these leaves here. I'm also using the stamp set uh, Textured Essential and I think this is retired now just for a bit of background texture Put that on there. and I need this stamp out Didn't bother with any of the stamps, um, getting any of the stamps out, which I should have done, but there we are, they're out. So, for this, you'll need a white card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths, scored at four and one eighth. Then you will need a piece of DSP at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths. No, not five and five eighths. Four and one eighths by five and seven eighths. Now I got carried away and I've already stuck the paper on the card. Now this DSP you get along with this stamp set. It's a bundle which you get free from Celebration. And I got carried away and stuck it down before I realised what I was doing. So yes, though it is a normal card base. And I've stuck the DSP all over the front. But we'll get on and do the rest. Oh, you also need a piece of oh, here it is. card at three and one eighths by four and one eighths. Three and one eighths by four and one eighths. And a piece at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths for the inside. I've also got a strip of black, which I think is an three quarters of an inch, and it will be three and one eighth because I will cut that down once I stick it on, and some scraps. So let's get on with oh, and a scrap of oh, I didn't bring it, I'll have to find some pool party to um, stamp these sentiment on I've got a scrap of full party here so that's some scraps that's the inside what did I do inside nothing So, with my textured piece and some pool party, we're just going to stamp this randomly anywhere. In fact, that's too dark, so I'm going to turn that off. Get a scrap of paper. Stamp it off and then stamp it down. That's better, that's all I want. Nothing too in your face. Now I've got some black. And with my twigs, I am going to stamp this off. Right, I've got my black piece of card. This way. And I want to stamp this so it's sticking out. And a piece there. And we're going just one here. Like that. And that will just sit there. 
and then come back to that. I want this pool party. And I forgot I added two of these leaves. That just stuck out here. Like that. going to do. I'm going to put one there. There we are. Alright, put that aside. Bring back these. Now I am going to stamp this bird. I'm going to stamp that in memento black ink because we're going to colour the bird in. And then we're going to cut it out by hand. Like that. And then I want to add the sentiment. And it says, hope you have the best birthday. We're going to stamp this on the poor party. straight that there. Like that. Now we have to find our pool party pens. It's collapsing at the side of me here. This pool party. Mint macaron. These two. Right. Got my light and my dark pool party. So I'm just going to go over it in the light. Use the other end. Pour it all in. And then with the dark, I'm just going to go over the top of the leave in the breast light. And we're going to blend that in a bit. Like that. That's all we're going to colour in. And we're going to cut that out with my paper snips. Just quite, really quite easy. Up 
I've got this in view. Yeah. There isn't a die to go with this, which is a shame. I quite like this set. As you most probably will be able to tell later on of the amount of cards I've made with it. his beak off. Right, there is our bird all chopped up and that will sit on there like that. Stick this down. Line it up like that. Make sure it's straight. And chop off the access. Don't need that. And I'm going to put this on my card base. Not very really often I cover a card completely in DSP, but I thought I would this time. And this I'm going to stick up like that. on dimensionals. A couple of little ones. I want to go on that flower. I want to go on its tail. All my nails are broken off. I had nice nails until I started making cards. And then I break them. Right, that is going to go there like that. And our sentiment, I'm going to use this. Actually got ordered ordered some blades for my stamping up trim, which will be here 
during the week sometime. Right, and this I'm going to sit down there on dimensionals that side. I think I need one. Two. Tiny one on this corner here. That's it. And then for the inside, I oh, like I said, I didn't do nothing, but I am going to put in my usual message wishing you a wonderful, oh, wishing you the most beautiful day. Let's do two. Put one in the other one. Close the ink up in case I get ink everywhere. There's no doubt I'll drop some in it. this one. Right. Only thing left is some gems in my flowers. Again, I'm using these black cheap gems. I think I've got them from Pamland. Put them on this one as well. That one can only have one on it. So there we have it, two pretty cards, I hope you like them, if you do give us a thumbs up, if you'd like to see more of my cards please subscribe and if you press the bell icon you'll be able to, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload, usually on a Monday and a Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon.